The Bayer Actor TB2 turned heads, but it was just the beginning. From Ukraine's stealthy strike drones to Russia's deadly Jiren 2, these 12 machines are changing the war. Number 1. Absolutely terrifying. Let's kick things off at number 12 with the Aurora Zbytka R18, a compact multi-rotor attack drone making a big impact. Developed by Ukraine's volunteer tech unit Aurora Zbytka, this drone isn't built for range, but it's deadly up close. It can reach 27 miles per hour, travel 12.4 miles, and stay airborne for 45 minutes. The R18 flies low, under 1,000 feet, making it ideal for sneaky strikes. It drops grenades or anti-armor charges straight onto enemy targets with pinpoint accuracy. Controlled with FPV goggles and a tablet, operators get a real-time battlefield view. It's been used in nighttime ambushes and urban battles around Kiv and Kharkiv. Lightweight and fast to deploy, the R-18 proves that even small drones can shift the momentum in war. And number 11 is the Molnia 2, Russia's low-cost fixed-wing drone used for recon and light strikes. With a range of 25 miles and cruise speed of 43 miles per hour, it tops out at 50 miles per hour and flies for around 40 minutes. Simple to operate and launch quickly, it's often deployed in swarms. Its main job is to scout Ukrainian positions and assist Russian artillery with targeting. It's also been used to jam communications or deliver explosives in custom versions. Lightweight wings help it dodge radar and make it highly portable. While not high-tech, its strength lies in numbers, fast, flexible, and built for battlefield saturation. At number 10 is the ZALA Lancet, Russia's notorious kamikaze drone. It's a loitering munition that flies over battle zones, then dives into targets with deadly precision. With a 25-mile range and 40-minute flight time, it cruises at 50 miles per hour and at 68 miles per hour at max speed. It soars up to 16,400 feet and features a dual camera system for real-time control. Used to take out howitzers, radars, and air defense, the Lancet hits hard. Compact and easy to deploy, it's been credited with destroying dozens of Ukrainian assets. Think of it as a flying missile with eyes. It hunts, locks, and eliminates with chilling efficiency. Ninth on our list is the ZALA Cub LA, Russia's compact and lethal kamikaze drone. Known for its silent, destructive strikes, this loitering munition is designed to hover near a target, then slam into it with precision. It has a max range of 25 miles, a top speed of 81 miles per hour, and cruises at 50 miles per hour. It flies for 30 minutes and can reach up to 16,400 feet. What makes it deadly is its portable design and catapult launch system allowing it to be deployed quickly in frontline zones. It's guided by real-time video, giving operators total control until the final strike. The Cub BLA is often used to hit enemy tanks, artillery, and radar systems. Lightweight and accurate, it's a serious threat hiding in the skies. Coming in at number 8 is Ukraine's very own Punisher, a tactical UAV that lives up to its name. Developed by UA Dynamics, this fixed-wing drone is built for precision strikes behind enemy lines. It has a max range of 28 miles, flies up to 125 miles per hour, cruises at 87 miles per hour, and can stay in the air for three hours. Though small in size, it's backed by the Spectre Scout drone, which marks targets for attack. The Punisher carries guided munitions and is often used to destroy Russian ammo depots, fuel trucks, and command vehicles with pinpoint accuracy. It's quick to launch, tough to detect, and extremely useful in Ukraine's hit and fade tactics. At number 7, we have the Lelika 100, one of Ukraine's most reliable eyes in the sky. This lightweight reconnaissance drone is crucial for frontline intelligence. It covers up to 62 miles, flies for 2.5 hours, and it's a top speed of 75 miles per hour, with a cruise speed of 43 miles per hour. With a max altitude of 4,900 feet, it gives commanders a bird's eye view of enemy forces. Ukrainian artillery units rely on it to pinpoint Russian tanks, bunkers, and troop movements. Fast to deploy, hard to jam, and easy to operate, the Lelika 100 has become a trusted companion on Ukraine's eastern front. Taking the sixth spot is the high-performing Furia, a Ukrainian surveillance drone built for endurance and altitude. Created by Athlan Avia, this UAV travels 62 miles, flies for up to three hours, and reaches a top speed of 81 miles per hour. It cruises at 40 miles per hour and can fly as high as 16,400 feet, well above most small arms range. Designed to spot enemy locations and guide long-range strikes, 
The FURIA has been instrumental in targeting Russian forces with AKIM and ADORS systems. It's hand-launched, tough to jam, and can operate even in bad weather. With crystal-clear visuals and strong encryption, the FURIA gives Ukrainian troops a powerful edge in modern warfare. Flying in at number 5 is Ukraine's Sharp-Eyed Shark Drone, built for deep reconnaissance and artillery correction. Designed by Ukraspec Systems, the Shark has a range of 186 miles and stays airborne for 4 hours. It flies up to 81 miles per hour, cruises at 47 miles per hour, and reaches a service ceiling of 9,800 feet. Its high-resolution camera and long-range encrypted data link make it ideal for directing precision artillery and missile strikes. The Shark can hover at a safe distance while feeding real-time video to command units. It's resistant to jamming and can operate in areas with strong electronic warfare. This drone has become a backbone of Ukraine's intelligence missions, watching, tracking, and helping to destroy key Russian assets from a safe distance. Securing the fourth position is the battle-tested Bayraktar TB2, a medium-altitude, long-endurance drone supplied by Turkey and heavily used by Ukraine. With a max range of 186 miles, this UAV cruises at 81 miles per hour. It's a top speed of 137 miles per hour and can stay in the sky for 27 hours. It reaches a service ceiling of 25,000 feet, making it one of the highest flyers in this war. What makes the TB2 a legend is its blend of surveillance and strike capability. It carries laser-guided bombs, tracks targets in real time, and can operate day or night. During the early phase of the war, TB2s were responsible for taking out convoys, air defenses, and even Russian naval assets. It's not just a drone, it's a symbol of modern asymmetric warfare, delivering results far beyond its cost. Holding the third spot is Russia's workhorse recon drone, the Orlin 10. This UAV has a long combat history and plays a vital role in Russian battlefield coordination. With a max range of 370 miles, it cruises at 68 miles per hour, reaches 93 miles per hour at top speed, and stays airborne for 16 hours. It operates at a ceiling of 16,400 feet and is typically launched via catapult. The Orlin 10's strength lies in its versatility. It provides live video, tracks troop movements, spots artillery positions, and even carries jamming modules to disrupt Ukrainian communications. Deployed in swarms or alone, it's often the first drone to spot targets before missiles follow. Its real value isn't flash. It's the consistent wide area surveillance that supports Russia's heavy firepower. Coming in at number two is the Kronstadt Orion, also known as Inakadets, a powerful, long endurance combat drone that plays a major role in Russia's drone strategy. With an impressive range of 890 miles and a flight time of 24 hours, this medium altitude UAV is built for extended missions far behind enemy lines. It reaches a top speed of 124 miles per hour, cruises at 75 miles per hour, and flies as high as 24,600 feet, keeping it safely out of reach for most ground-based threats. Often described as Russia's answer to the USM Q9 Reaper, the Orion is equipped for both intelligence gathering and precision strikes. It carries air-to-ground missiles and laser-guided bombs, allowing it to hit armored vehicles, bunkers, radar sites, and fortify positions with deadly accuracy. The Orion can transmit real-time surveillance while simultaneously preparing for an attack, making it a true dual-role platform. Although not deployed in massive numbers, every Orion launch is deliberate and calculated, delivering maximum impact with each mission. Its combination of range, altitude, and strike capability places it among the most elite drones in modern warfare. And finally, at number one is the most feared name in this drone war. The Jiren 2, also known globally as the Iranian-made Shade 136. With a jaw-dropping range of 1,240 miles, this loitering munition can stay in flight for up to 12 hours, cruises at 111 miles per hour, and reaches a top speed of 115 miles per hour. It flies at a service ceiling of 13,000 feet and carries a high-explosive warhead capable of causing devastating damage on impact. Russia rebrands and deploys it in massive swarms, designed to saturate and overwhelm Ukrainian air defenses with sheer volume. Despite its basic build, its simplicity is what makes it so dangerous. It's cheap, mass-producible, and incredibly hard to intercept in groups. The Jiren 2 is frequently used to destroy critical infrastructure, including power stations, fuel depots, bridges, and ammo dumps. Its chilling engine buzz has become a sound of destruction across the Ukrainian sky. 
with terrifying persistence and destructive reach. This kamikaze drone has solidified its position as the most impactful UAV of the Russia-Ukraine war to date. These 12 drones have turned the skies into the most dangerous battlefield of the 21st century, each one faster, smarter, and deadlier than the last. Subscribe for more powerful military breakdowns, and don't forget to like, share, and let us know which drone shocked you the most.